Hi, my name is Mr. Nuchko, and I'm one of the Comp Tech teachers here at Spruce Grove Composite High School. In this short little video, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about what Communication Technologies is all about and how we've designed our program. Also, because we can't meet in person, I'd love to take you around, show you our lab. So let's get started. Communication technology at Spruce Grove Composite High School is all about student choice. In that students who take this class get to choose what they want to learn about. And there's a lot of things they can choose from. So for example, students could choose to learn about photography, how to take better pictures. Um, they could use some of the equipment here, or they could learn how to use their own devices they have at home or even mobile devices. Students can learn about video making and uh, animation, web design, or they could choose to do uh, graphic design, marketing, advertising, and uh, do all sorts of designs on the computer. This is pretty cool because once you make your projects, then you could choose how you want to output them. You could make them into stickers, decals, t-shirts, posters, or just print them out on paper and hang them in your locker or around your room. Not only do students get the opportunity to choose what they're going to learn about, but they also get the, to develop critical thinking and problem solving skills as they choose how they learn about these different things. Students are required to design all of their own projects. So if you're interested in skateboarding or music, all of your projects can be about those two things. Um, if you like hockey or horses, video games, you guessed it. And if you happen to be a person who loves squirrels, then we got some pretty good news for you. Essentially, the only way that this course could possibly be boring is if you yourself are a boring person, but then you'll probably enjoy yourself because you like boring things. So that's great. In addition to learning how to learn and designing a personalized course about whatever you want to learn about, ComTech also offers some other very unique learning opportunities. For example, we have the opportunity for students to get involved and engaged in some client service work where they do real life work, real life jobs for real clients. Um, it's really satisfying to sort of actually be doing something that you can see out in the community and people wearing or, or groups and teams using, or posters hanging on the wall. Um, you can work on projects from other classes for cross-curricular opportunities. So you could do stuff for your social studies class or science class make presentations or videos for all of those things. And we also um, try to engage here in photography trips. We do in-person, sort of like in the field learning about how to use some of the skills that we learn about in class, sort of in the field. And, and we conduct an outdoor photography module. Um, usually I try to go to Phoenix, Arizona every year with a small group of students. And we do, we do um, all of that photography work down there. It's a lot of fun. Um, if international travel is not an option in the future, I look at possibly designing some trips um, more locally and uh, perhaps in the mountains and stuff. Um, typically, I get two concerns from students who are worried about taking this class. The first concern is that they're not really creative people. Well, guess what? Creativity is a skill. And this is something that we learn about and we learn to do in ComTech. So if you're not a creative person, or you don't feel like you're a creative person, this would be a great class for you to take because you can learn about how to be creative. The other concern is that they're not good with computers. Well, this is a computer class and we teach you those computer skills. So if you're not comfortable and not great on computers, again, another great option for you to take this class because you'll learn those things. If you do consider yourself to be a creative person or good on computers, then you're gonna love it in this class because that's basically what we do. Really, there's something here for everyone and you won't regret taking this class. The last thing I wanna mention is that ComTech is a 10, 20, 30 level course. So there's an opportunity to take it um, all throughout your high school career. And you can use ComTech 30 as entrance into a lot of post-secondary institutions. So it counts towards your Rutherford scholarship and you can use it in uh, all of your post-secondary applications. So I really encourage you to um, try to learn more about this and uh, I can't wait to see you in the fall.